I definitely agree that the genre and the, the, and the scale uh, is definitely different. That's also one of the main attraction points for me. I was, I, I've never did anything that was set in a supernatural realm, so to speak, and that had that scale, that scope. Uh, so I found that, and that was based on a, on a graphic novel. So I found that a challenge. Um, and, 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 and I think that, I mean, I resonated with the character. The character really resonated with me and, and because he has a pretty existential journey and, and he's battling demons. He's, he's questioning his life, his future, his, his, uh, yeah, his, his relationship with eternity and immortality. So, so I think it's a very relatable um, quest that he's on. And, and, and I, I, yeah, it, it touched me. It touched me. Especially there's one particular scene in the movie that I'm not going to spoil. And that scene, made, that, that's the scene that made me want to do the movie. If that scene wouldn't have been in there, I would have liked the project, but I wouldn't have done it. It's, it's just really that scene that triggered me. And, that, and that, that's where my heart got connected to the, to the matter, to, to, the, to the project. And that's, that, that, was, that was my gasoline. That was the thing that I was rooting for. That's the thing I was like, yeah, that, to me, that was kind of the core of, 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 of what the All Guard is about. And, and, and I was glad that I was able to, 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 do, uh, to have that scene. And that's the thing that pulled me in. And then, of course, working with all you know, the amazing actors like uh, Charlize, Kiki, Luca, Marwan, not so much, but uh, <laughs> no, and, and Marwan also. No, we had a great team, you know, great, great town, motivated people, enthusiastic people. And, uh, and then also the travel component. Yeah, I, I, there was a lot to love about it. Yeah. But the, 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 the core thing was, was definitely the heart for me of this project was that very specific scene that, that really made sense to me and that, and that I saw as a challenge and that, and that for me kind of synthesized what the old guard is about. Yeah. They try to install justice. I mean, not install, but they just try to fight for justice and try to stand up against any kinds of oppression and, 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 and try to be on the good side, try to be on the side of the oppressed and try to fight for liberation, try to fight for justice, try to fight for, yeah, try, try to fight all kinds of injustice, basically. I felt immediately in, in <clears throat> love with, with the story and, and with the message of, of this movie. And, and I think how the movie is dealing with, with a lot of theme. Um, and, and, and I'm, I will say that I'm very proud of, of, of being part of, of, of this movie that, that, that shared this, this message of, of great love for people and, and humanity. There is a huge message of uh, participate uh, to the present because they they oh, ask. That's true. That's for, true. Very important. You're right. They they participate in the present time. You know, um, they are there in that moment and they are fighting for something that they believe is good. Um, so I think that's that's one important message that I hope the the, the audience is going to bring. Home. Hey, don't close out. Stay with me because I have a really cool movie fact. Did you know the Hollywood star who played the most leading roles in feature films was John Wayne, who appeared in 153 movies? Now, you don't always have to have the leading roles to make records, as the star with the most screen credits is John Carradine, who had been in over 230 movies. Now, hmm, do you like my shirt? Get one for yourself in the link in the description.